hassle, YouTubers. This is what you call Africa. Africa woman. She gon' say I be lady. She gon' say I be lady. Energy, energy, energy. Okay. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Jay here. So this is sort of a collab with Africa Fashion Week. I'm coming to you guys today to bring the African tag or the Nigerian tag. I was supposed to do one with my friend, so I'm gonna upload another video with something similar but a bit more spice with a friend of mine. So it's not just, oh yeah, Nigerian and just all about me alone. So yeah, thank you to all of you guys who are subscribed to my channel and um, I'm really excited for what's to come um, in 2017 and in 2018 because I feel like so much is going on so quickly and um, I don't really know how to do, um, keep calm with everything that's going on. But yeah, I hope you enjoy this tag. It's going to be super short, super quick, super fun, just bringing you African vibes. Where's my pineapple? Featuring best friend and twin. Tastes just like me. <laughs> I've seen Cinderella OG do it. So big up Cinderella OG. Um, she's another YouTuber and she did um, a Nigerian tag with her friend. That's what I'm gonna do today. So yeah, let's get into it. First question is, what is your Nigerian name? So I have a couple of Nigerian names as most Nigerians do. I have a few, but the two I'm gonna say is Bemisola, which means God has carried me into wealth. Um, so that's a Yoruba name, because I am Yoruba. So that should have been the first question, but. And um, Omoseke or Omosheke, something like that. Can't remember what that means low-key relevant but probably relevant, relevant so the next question is was i born in nigeria i was not born in nigeria um i was born in london but i feel like being born in nigeria just gives you this hustle mentality and it's just rough not rough but it's just it's it gives you life before you have a choice to witness it so but yeah that's a whole nother topic for another day okay next question my favorite nigerian movie I don't know what my favourite Nigerian movie is. It might have to be Two Rats, because Two Rats are just hilarious. Two, those two, Aki and Popo, are just hilarious. So I feel like it's probably Two Rats. And make sure you guys comment below with your favourite movie or any recommendations of Nigerian movies, because I'm still, I love Nigerian movies. Because like there's always um, like a moral, there's always like a feed, there's always like something to learn, you know, something that someone's gone through and that you can learn from. So. I want to just dance with this pineapple for a second. This that song reminds me of Bob Risky so bad because he's he was always on Snap just shaking his waist to it. But yeah, next question. Um, favorite Nigerian song. Hmm. Favorite Nigerian song. I can't. Can I um? Can I say one? I can't say one. Come on, man. Come on, mate. And I have to sing it. Favorite Nigerian song, and I have to sing it. Okay, what are we singing? I could sing, because I'm like an R&B girl, so I kind of like very slow songs and very meaningful songs. Like, Logo's brought out some incredible songs. But I don't know if I should go all the way back. Okay, at the moment, I'm loving Iskaba. So I'm just gonna Iskaba, Iskere Beti, Iskuro Butu. Original babe, not made in China, not made in China. Okay, that's not really singing, is it? I'll sing another one. Okay, Asha. Um, what is the name of the song? I'll put Asha in the name of the song here, but the song goes. Um, Favorite song, I can't remember the lyrics. Well, it used to be my everything, treating me like I was a queen. 
What spell do you cast on me? Or is it a make-believe? You say, girl, never be afraid of ever, ever loving me. Those words I hung on to. Oh, God, I was a fool. You became my bad habit, keeping up appearances so you can notice. Okay, I don't know if that counts because it's not even in a... Um, um, in a specific dialect so it's english so oh my gosh for life i'm gonna play this song it's by um run town i've been it's been making me feel like i don't know like i'm some sort of spice or something i don't know and i love it so let's go energy 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 <laughs> My doctor said my joy on top of your body oh. All these times where you do me bad, I'm sorry you oh. <laughs> Give me love with better pass money oh. It's sweet pass honey oh. hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. If I fight, we get back funny love mm -hmm. If I break, we get face mm -hmm. No one, no complication This is the situation if I fight, make a fight for the And you actually have to make that face whilst you're singing Nigerian songs and bend. The shoulders, the back, and the booty. The booty is like, honestly, the most important part. That's probably why African men are crazy over booty. But yeah. Okay, okay, the next question is, what is your favourite Nigerian food? Yes, so my favourite Nigerian food would be 100% jollof rice, only because I can eat it like every day if I wanted to. Um, but my soup will probably have to be stew. No, my soup will have to be um, ogono. I love ogono because it reminds me of okra and I love okra too. So okra, ogono, I love jordra soups. Jordra, jordra. I love those kind of suits because it's just it's vegetables as well um obviously effort is when it's made properly effort is just and then you see oh my god it's too much oh, it's too much it's too much either one either way i'm in love next question okay next question is when was the last time you've been to nigeria and how many times have you been um, I've been to Nigeria a couple times, maybe a few, maybe five or less, not too many times. Um, and the last time I went was probably like three years ago, maybe four, four years ago, probably four years ago. Um, okay, what child am I? I am Yoruba. I am Yoruba. Ni miyo. Swaga. Hey, I got too much. Where my people there? Where my people there? Where my Yoruba people there? <laughs> my accent is so poor, but guys, just bear with me, okay? Say something in your tribal language. Okay, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, good evening. Ekasan, Ekasan ma, Ekasan sa, Ekasan. YouTubers. Um, yeah, I don't really um. I don't really know how to speak that well, um, but I'm, I'm getting there, I'm getting there. What do you like most about Nigeria? I like, what I like about Nigeria is the food, the people, the culture. Um, yes, I love the food because it's just out of this world. A lot of staple West African dishes are from Nigeria, okay? And also because of Nigeria, there's so many, like there's the northern northerners, there's the um, southerners, and we're all so diverse, all so different, but we're still all Nigerian or all, you know, yeah, Nigerian. So I love that. I love the diversity in Nigeria. So yeah. What do I hate most about Nigeria? Oh, honestly, um, what I hate most about Nigeria is just the corruption, if I'm very honest. Um, people talk about the distribution of wealth. I'm sorry to go off on a tangent, but people talk about the distribution of wealth in the UK 
and I'm just like compare it to places like Nigeria where literally there's always not in a rude way but there are a lot of women homeless on the street um sometimes pregnant you know um so that kind of part of it really bothers me I think another part that bothers me is um I think I can kind of generalize it with Africa it's just or even some some possibly some places in the Caribbean as well it's almost where they're kind of going through this this I don't know if it's self-realization or it's like they're almost like a couple of years back in my opinion because a lot of people are like bleaching now um with people like Bobby I'm not saying it's wrong I'm just saying from from my from my opinion and from my understanding um you're either bleaching to dark to lighten certain parts of your face because maybe they're dark spots of course but or you're bleaching to change your entire skin tone and this is not to judge anybody for doing it this is not to say that it's wrong this is just to say personally I feel it's a thing of with a lot of Nigerians it's a thing of the lighter you are the more beautiful you are and it's only now in other parts of the world where people are kind of understanding that black is actually beautiful oh my this is all my hair ladies and gents all mine all mine okay told y'all i was coming i was coming and here i am okay do you have any nigerian nicknames i do have nigerian nicknames but i don't really want to say them i was a lot younger when people used to call me um, the nigerian nickname and it was just a shortening of my nigerian name and it's just a bit annoying a little bit a little bit just a little bit what makes you different from other nigerians is the fact that i think before being a nigerian i'm a human you know i'm a human being i'm a woman you know so before being a nigerian i'm a human being and i'm a woman um, and i'm a child of god so that means that there's a lot of things within the culture that i don't necessarily agree with i'm not going to talk about it just now sure um during the course of my videos you guys will see what i don't agree with you probably if you follow me on snapchat make sure you follow me on snapchat because that's where most of the stuff is going down if you want to see it before instagram if you want to see it before twitter if you want to see it before youtube follow me on snap maggi and make sure you holler even if you want to just comment in the description box below comment share love just follow me follow what's going on and i'll follow you guys back so yes um what makes me different from other nigerians is just that i'm more of a humanitarian than necessarily a nigerian because there's a lot of things within the nigerian culture that i feel in turn instead of um liberating and uplifting it kind of hinders you i'm just not I'm not limited by just being Nigerian. So I'm just gonna put it out there. I love my Nigerian brodem. So, babes, I know you're watching. I'd love for you. <laughs> but um, yeah, I think what makes it different is just that I'm just not, I don't put, I take the beauty out of it. I'm gonna take the beauty out of everything, you know? Like, you see how Drake is like a culture vulture? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take the um, clothes. I'm gonna take the hair. I'm gonna take the, um, you know just the beautiful things the beautiful things that are that are you know so much from them when they say do you speak your language um i don't speak my language because it wasn't taught to me um but i can understand little bits here and there but i really am trying to get a bit better because it's crucial to understand like i've said before um do you speak pidgin english no i don't um well i can if i understand what i'm saying but not really no what around your house represents culture um around my house this this um i've got another rapper that i'm going to do in the next video with my friend um possibly and this this is from africa what is a ridiculous question you were asked about your culture um a ridiculous question i was asked about my culture was do I speak other language? Do I speak like European languages in my um, country? Because, for example, places like Ivory Coast, um, they speak French. So people have asked, do I speak Portuguese and stuff like that? I'm just like, I speak Yoruba. That's it for today with the Nigerian tag with your sister. 
the sister J. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. Um, please, please, please comment down below um, if you have anything you want, like for me to do or to say or to even make. If you would like for me to make a Nigerian dish or show you more of my culture, I'm more than willing to do that. Uh, um, guys, it's been a pleasure creating this video. I've had so much fun doing it. Um, the makeup took ages, so I'm going to let y'all, you know, let y'all um, decide what you think of the makeup. It's something different, um, just with a little African spice. I was trying to be a like Felakuti dancer or I don't know, just that kind of vibe on my snap i've been dancing so guys honestly make sure you follow me on snap because that's where you'll get the real essence of me peace yeah i freaking love these lashes like most lashes that are big i don't like because they don't suit my eyes but these oh my gosh y'all will not be disappointed